Buddy, that's a picture of us singing that song uh, at the Houston Rodeo. And uh, we had the largest crowd, like I say, Patrick, Buddy was from Houston. We had the largest crowd to ever see a rodeo anywhere on the face there. It had 48,618 people. And it was amazing. We had, uh, and we held that world record for about five years until the folks uh, in charge of the Astrodome, they figured out a way to squeeze in 5,000 more seats. And uh, that scoundrel, George Strait, broke our record. <laughs> <laughs> if you're going to have somebody break it, that's not a bad deal. But like I say, Patrick's from Houston. We, we miss him. I wear this, uh, his, his widow, Lisa, gave me this armband, kind of remind us to you know, we donate to pancreatic cancer research. It's a horrible disease. That's what Patrick died of. And uh, we miss him. Uh, first met him in uh, 1986. We were in Austin, Texas. And we're doing a big TV special for CBS, and it was to commemorate the uh, Texas... The what? 150 year birthday, Texas. <laughs> Anyways, we're doing this big TV show and we were on a little rehearsal break. So I was going to go down to get a hamburger and the elevator door opened and there's Patrick Swayze standing by himself. You know, and I, I, in the elevator, I said, Patrick Swayze, I love your acting. You're great. He said, Larry Gatton, I love your song and your singing. I said, let's be friends. He said, we already are. And I stuck out his hand. It was wonderful. And, uh, you know, he had just done that big movie, North and South, and everybody knew he was going to be a big star. So we visited a little bit. We became friends. He called me uh, two or three years later. I mean, we'd hung out in L.A., but uh, he called me and uh, said, Larry Wayne. I said, what? He said, where are you? I said, I'm in Nashville. I said, where are you? He said, I'm in Chicago. I said, on purpose? <laughs> he said, yeah, they're paying me awfully well to be up here in this cold country and making a movie. And it's about uh, three brothers who kind of, Stuck together through thick and thin, kind of like you and your brothers. Won't you write us a song for it? So I wrote it. You've always known if anyone tried to get to you, they'd first have to get through me. You've always known I'd be by your side, no matter what the situation might be. When we were just boys, we Shoulder to shoulder against all others Shoulder to shoulder against all